I like this one because it's my favorite. A little brother fondly looks at pictures of his older brother, 26-year-old Kijan Marquis Cousins Starks. What are you going to miss about your brother? His personality. I just want to miss that every day. Cousin Stark's mother meets with family and friends at the site where someone shot her son early Saturday morning in Natomas. I just love him so much. Yeah, I'm gonna miss him. Police say someone found Cousin Starks dying in his car that crashed into a fence at Edmonton Drive and Northstead Drive. Investigators say a van at the scene belongs to an acquaintance of the victim. Cousin says her son used to live in the neighborhood. I can't really process my son's what's going on, the grieving part of it, because I'm still want to know what happened to my son. Cousin says all she has now is her son's music. This is his first CD. He like did everything himself. When he was 11, she noticed his passion for music, and by 16, he was recording original songs. It was like a whole song. I just couldn't believe that he made this song, and it rhymed and it made sense. And that's when I knew that he was very talented, and he just continued to write and write and write and write, and then he just started rapping. And he's Cousin says she'll miss their daily talks. They chatted on the phone just a few hours before the shooting, and she'll never forget the last time she saw her son two days before he died. We just laughed, and I gave him a kiss, told him I love him, and that was it. We always do it. Every time he leaves me, he hugs me like it's the last time. And he kisses me and tells me he loves me. In Natomas, Michelle Bandor, KCRA 3 News. Well, police are still investigating and looking for the gunman. They have made no arrests.